you guys and welcome back to another tutorial video where today I'm going to be showing you guys how to fix the can't resolve hostname and unknown host error that you sometimes get when connecting to Minecraft servers. So guys it's actually a pretty simple quick and easy fix and but not too many people know about it so I figured I'd show you. So once again we can start out looking at Boba Fett for inspiration now that that's all taken care of guys. What you want to do if you're on a Windows computer is go down and click the Windows symbol that should bring up a bar like this guys and what you're going to type in is network and somewhere along the way guys you should see network and sharing center even on updated versions of windows it should be called this and you're going to click that guys and it should look something like this what you want to do when you get to a page like this guys is simply just find a um, thing you can click that says change adapter settings guys like right here you're going to click on that and then you're gonna come over to the, the network you're on so obviously there's a lot of networks here but this is the one I'm on this is the one that's giving me internet access so what you guys are gonna do is right click it and then you're gonna come down all the way to properties guys when you click and then you're gonna click on properties and this is where it gets a little more technical but it's still pretty easy guys you're gonna come down to the internet protocol version 4 TCP IPv4 alright not the v6 the v4 you guys are gonna come highlight this and click properties now it's gonna take you to this page guys and this is where you're gonna need to do some work so you're not gonna mess with this at all guys but you're gonna come down here the DNS server guys it's picking up an, an address automatically and that's the problem with how you're not gonna be able to get on specific servers so what you're gonna have to do is give it a broader range guys so you're gonna click use the following and you're gonna plug in your DNS servers manually that it can span between so guys the numbers you're gonna plug in um, I already have right here so we'll just kinda make these a bit smaller and I will have these in the description guys just in case you can't see but in the top line here guys oh dear alright we're gonna we're gonna hate this is an issue we're gonna drag this over here alright perfect in this top line here guys you are gonna type 208 and then the middle line 67 then you're gonna click over here guys and do 222 and then 222 alright and in this line over here guys you're gonna do 208 once again 67 then you're gonna come over here and click 220 so 220 and 220 again guys you're simple and then after that guys you simply click OK you have increased your range after that you guys can just simply hit close on here close on here don't need this anymore even we can close uh, actually we're actually just gonna minimize that cuz I have to put it in your video description but yeah guys and so now that will have actually fixed your host name guys and your unknown host and all of that so guys I told you it'd be a simple quick and easy video I got some complaints that it was happening them and I really just don't want to see any complications come up guys and uh, this will help um, with any server that it's giving you that unknown host for but uh, just a shameless plug here guys I actually have my own server my own modded server I have a video on it link will be in the description and uh, I had a couple of people say this was happening to them for getting on the server so this is another tutorial video guys just to show you how you can get on I'm looking forward to playing with you guys and if you have any other tutorial videos you'd like me to go over or anything you'd like me to show you how to do technically wise then please just do let me know guys and yeah this has been Adam and Chef for now and I'll see you guys all next time goodbye